Hey everybody, welcome back. Wanted to do a quick example here of using VPN to speed up your download in Microsoft Flight Simulator. I did a video on this a while back and I had some skeptics and I completely understand that because I didn't show a video of it actually happening, but I was recently downloading the Sim Update 15 beta and I noticed that the download speed is really slow. If you notice, it was about 1.4, 1.5 megabytes per second at the start of this video. And so what I did was real quick hit record and just recorded the entire download process. Now you only saw a few seconds there at the beginning, but that's what it was. It was about 1.5, 1.4 megabytes per second or megabits per second on the download. And as soon as I opened up NordVPN, and I'm not endorsing NordVPN in particular, but as soon as I opened up NordVPN, which is what I use, and I just clicked quick connect real quick, you can see what happens and I think in the video that I did previously I mentioned using I believe the Netherlands as a download or excuse me as a VPN connection and this particular time I literally just hit quick connect and it connected to somewhere in the United States which is what you can expect it to do but you can see clearly now that the uh, the speeds have jumped up quite a bit and I recorded the entire process of downloading it because I didn't want you to think that it jumped real quick to a higher speed and then slowed down as I was recording this I was curious myself because I was you know obviously didn't know at that point what was going to happen but suffice it to say I think this video proves it quite conclusively that if you are having really slow download speeds downloading sim updates and I know a lot of people do solution to that may very well be for you to try a VPN and again I'm not endorsing NordVPN just happens to be the one that I use and I know there are free VPNs out there that I have seen reports of people using to overcome this issue as well I have, after this video, seeing what the difference was, done some further research on some other things with VPNs and not really quite sure that there's anything else to bring you there, maybe. But I did want to at least share this with you guys so that you could see the proof is in the pudding. And I mean, presumably the only thing. The only way I can really, you know, completely confirm this is if I do another download the same way. I don't always have speed problems downloading the updates, and I've done a ton of them because I've been in, I can't even count how many betas now and how many beta versions there are in each particular one. But suffice it to say, I've done quite a few betas, like I said, uh, or quite a few downloads, rather. And like I said, I don't always have these super slow speeds. Or sometimes, to be honest, I haven't even paid attention. I just start downloading it and start doing other things and then come back. But I know some people are, are having chronic ongoing issues with low download speeds. And my recommendation is to give this a try. So take it for what it's worth certainly worked for me in this particular instance and I had it work for me another time that I didn't record it which is the basis for the previous video that I did so up to you guys but I did want to share this in hopes that at least some people who are having this issue can be helped and hopefully we'll get this this sim update 15 beta or the sim update 15 officially released and out to everybody soon that would be great it's running quite well so we shall see the downloads finishing up as is this video i hope you guys are doing well and take care